everyone, welcome back to our channel, The Soren Seward Family. I'm Ivy, thank you for joining me for another makeup papa. And y'all already know how I feel about makeup and beauty products, period. So I wanted to come and show you some things that I have been interested in or that I've been using. You guys, I copped a new palette from Morph. I'm also wearing some lashes and I'm gonna tell you how you can get those lashes. And just, you know, chit chat with you. See what's going on. Happy New Year, by the way. Check it out. If you guys are wondering how I got this look, what palette I used, I used the 39L Hit The Lights by Morph. I am in love with this palette. When I first saw it, I did not buy it. I waited and then I got a Christmas gift card for my hubby dubby and I went back and I got it, you guys. Take a look at this palette. This palette comes with 39 amazing shades, mattes, glitters, shimmers. It is just amazing. I feel like any look that you are trying to do, you can accomplish with this palette. For this look that I have right now, I used Darling, Hot Stuff, Severe Looks, Till Dawn, Obsessive, 2 AM, Live It Up, and No Regret. And I have no regrets about this look. I am absolutely in love with this palette. Morph never lets me down. I just wanna let you guys know that. Morph never ever lets me down. If you're interested in this palette, I highly, highly suggest that you go and you get it. This palette was worth every single bit of the $35. I love the packaging. Look at the lights. It is just so colorful. And then I just love when you open it. It is so cute. Look, you guys. So, of course, it's gonna have all the names of the shades. But I love this part right here. You see that? It still keeps the same consistency with what's going on in the front. And the boxing is pretty huge, you guys. This is not a small palette. This palette, look at my hand, okay? Look at the palette. Ugh, huge. You are gonna get your bang for your buck and I hope that you guys go out and get it. If you do go out and get it, let me know how you like it. I love it and I think that I will be doing another look because there's so many that I can accomplish with just this one palette. Ah, you guys know I love makeup. Okay, moving on to the next thing. <laughs> next, I wanna come and talk to you about these lashes. These lashes that I have on, I took some photos that I'm going to insert while I talk about the lashes. These lashes that I have on are called Diamond. I love these lashes. They are absolutely so cute and they're so light. They're long, but they're light. They feel like I don't have anything on. I can still see and I'm not looking at eyelashes. I will insert her link in the description box and I will put her YouTube page right here just in case you guys want to go and check her out because these are where I got these lashes from. All right, on to the next. This is Makeup Pop-Up. I don't want to take too much of your time, but you know what I'm like, take your time, Pastor, take your time, Pastor. You better preach about those staying on task here we go the next two things I want to talk to you about with my rings just don't they, they I'm losing weight and my rings don't fit anymore I know I keep I know y'all tired of hearing it it's 2020 don't bring that mess up in here the sharp tape sharp tape is what I conceal with this is what I contour with so wherever you see the dark like you see how my cheekbones are like mm-hmm mm-hmm can you see that that is where I use this. And this is the shade Espresso because I'm dark and you know, we gotta express yourself. Don't tell me what I cannot do, baby. Hey, go ahead and work your... Espresso Sharp Tape to do the contouring. And I um, highlight with Sharp Tape in deep sand. So this is what I use under my eyes. It's what I use on my nose and on my chin and blend that in and set it. And these are what I use to contour with. I got it from Ulta Beauty. Go ahead and copy some. A little goes a long way. Please listen to me when I tell you. A little go a long way. You will be looking a hot mess if you use too much of these okay to do your contour so if you look you can see where i did a cut crease i also cut my crease with the highlighter are you y'all probably want me to do a look the video is coming soon don't you fret as soon as i get those lights in i am going to do makeup tutorials you guys you ask for it they're coming don't ask me when i gotta wait for them lights to get here okay we gotta we working on some things okay it's the year 2020 and we about to do it yourself together young lady get yourself 
together. There are kids watching. Your kids are watching. Now, let's discuss the last two products that I have with you guys. As you guys know, I have huge pores. That means I have like little holes in my face that makes me feel all like, why are you so big? Why can't you guys just close up? But you know what? That's just the way I am. That's the skin that God gave me and we're going to be working with that. So, e.l.f. has putty. Poreless putty primer. That's what e.l.f. has. And it helps me, okay? It helps me feel a little more smooth this canvas out. You feel me? So, if you open it, it is like the consistency of putty. Yeah, but it goes on like transparent. You cannot see it. You put it in and it kind of makes my face all primed and, and, and just like feeling good and smooth all over. You guys, please do not apply any foundation without priming your face first. You know how like um you butter your pan? Let, let me use that. You know how you butter your pan before you put the cornbread or the cake or you oil down your skillet before you put the eggs or whatever it is that you're putting in your skillet? This is how primer works when you apply it to your face, okay? It needs something to build on. I use e.l.f. Poreless, I can't, I can't talk. I use, I use e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer to help me with my pores to make them appear more smaller. And I also use this. This right here is amazing. I can spray it on for you right now too, okay? This is hydrating primer mist. You can put it on your face before and after you're finished with your finished look. I put this on before I put the putty on. So I spray my face, then it's still moist, and then I take this primer and I put it on so my face be looking all smooth and just mm, all ready for that makeup to get put on to my face. Got a little too excited there, I know. But even after you finish your face, you have to set your face, you guys. When you're done with your foundation, when you put your foundation on and your face is looking all cool or whatever, you need to set your face. If you do not have a setting spray, please go out and get this e.l.f. because it does double duty. Double duty, you guys. Like, I'm gonna put it on right now. Even though my face is finished, if I wanna spruce it up, hold it back like this, you guys. Mmm. It feels so refreshing. Oh, and then you just fan it like this. Look, you guys. Just look. Can you can you see it? Hey, how you doing? Fresh face there? Yes! Do you see it? So I would definitely recommend this for you guys. All right, you guys, that's all I have for you today with makeup pop-up. I will be popping up again very soon just for you. And thank you so much for joining our channel. If you have not subscribed to our channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and smash that subscribe button, ring that notification bell so you can be notified whenever we upload a video. We don't only do makeup here, we do life and we want to do it with you. Stay blessed, stay true, and continue to be you because the world needs more people like who? like you. And if you're not feeling needed, whenever you come to the Soren Seaman Family Channel, we want you to know that you are needed. Stay blessed, great people. Peace out.